Today we're going to be solving the quadratic function y equals x squared plus 2x minus 3. The first thing you want to do is to find your factors, which in this case is x plus 3 and x minus 1. The next thing you want to do is to set each factor equal to 0, which I did here by setting x plus 3 and x minus 1 equal to 0. The result of doing this will be finding your zeros on your parabola, which are x equals negative 3 and x equals 1. The next thing you want to do to solve this function is to calculate the vertex. The first step in calculating the vertex is to find the average of the zeros. You add the zeros together, negative 3 and negative 1, which equals negative 2. And then since there are two zeros on this graph, you divide by 2, and then your answer will be negative 1. Negative 1 is the x value on the vertex. And to find the y value, you just plug the x value back into the original equation. So you would have negative 1 squared plus 2 times negative 1 minus 3. And when you do this, you'll find that the y value of your vertex, which is negative 4. So your vertex will be negative 1 comma negative 4. And this point is a, min is a minimum on the graph since a is a positive value. Here's the graph of the function y equals x squared plus 2x minus 3. Here I have both zeros labeled, which are negative 3, 0, and positive 1, 0. Also, I have the vertex labeled down here, which is negative 1, negative 4. Also, here I have the axis of symmetry labeled, which is just on the line x equals negative 1. The axis of symmetry divides the parabola into two equal halves. Thanks for watching.